If you're homeless or threatened with homelessness, there are a number of ways that the council can help you. One of these is the Let's Rent scheme. The council runs this, providing both practical and financial support to people who are looking for a privately rented property. If you join the Let's Rent scheme, you may be able to receive tenancy support, help with budgeting your money, help set up utility supplies, claiming benefits, help with removals and essential household items, getting back into work and managing a tenancy. Rent deposit. Up to one month of rent paid in advance. A grant or interest-free loan to cover the difference between your housing-related benefit and your rent for a period of time. To qualify for the scheme, you need to be homeless or threatened with homelessness within 56 days. Unfortunately, if you have a history of antisocial behaviour, rent arrears, or a county court judgment, CCJ, you will not be able to join. So here's what you need to do if you're interested in the scheme. Get in touch with the housing options team. Depending on your situation, they may be able to help you during that first call. If they can't, you may be offered a full assessment and a personal housing plan. One of the things you may need to do as part of your plan is to complete a Let's Rent referral form. Where appropriate, you'll be expected to apply for a discretionary housing payment from the council to assist with meeting the cost. If you are accepted onto the scheme, the Let's Rent team will start looking for suitable properties for you, making sure that they are affordable and that they are a reasonable distance from where you work, children's schools and support services. You should also start looking for properties yourself and get in touch with the Let's Rent team as soon as you find one that's suitable. When a suitable property has been found, the Let's Rent team will offer you a tenancy support and financial package that's right for you. The aim of the package is to help you get the tenancy and keep it. This may include payment of the rent deposit and first month's rent. You will also be given support for the first 12 weeks to help you stay on top of your finances and be a good tenant. A home visit will be carried out to check you are managing your new tenancy and to make sure that you are okay and not having any problems with your landlord. To find out if you qualify for a discretionary housing payment, visit the council website and search for discretionary housing payment.